In today's video, a Gen Z OnlyFans girl is facing a difficult question. What product are you providing to the market? Let's go straight to the video and watch the entire debate. For those who are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We keep bringing such interesting videos here that are very helpful in improving your thinking and personality. Let's start. A lot of things will be hard for you to comprehend. That's why you're in sex work because you can't offer value in the marketplace. What the fuck? And don't worry, I'm not really talking to you. I'm speaking against you as a symbol. Mm -hmm. So don't take personal as a symbol, offense which is to what? it. A symbol of what? A symbol of a declining society where people gotcha. lack values. If you had IQ and skills mm -hmm. to offer to the marketplace, gotcha. you can earn a good income. Being that the most valuable thing about you is mm -hmm. something that you never earned. You didn't earn knowledge. You didn't earn skills. It's your breast that you paid for and your butthole. So you market that to earn money. There is no skill set is the point, which is to say if, if I took your brain and placed your brain into a man's body, you would be in poverty. Mm, you're right, yeah. I'm just good for nothing. Yep, you comment. No, you are good for something. That's why you have OnlyFans. And that's my point, is that oh, that's what you're good for. Yeah. This guy has mostly said things correctly, but I have objections to some of his words. I think if better words were used instead, the person listening to you would understand better and your words could inspire some improvement in them. But if the words are a bit harsh, the person listening might get angry at the words instead of understanding the point. The issue isn't that the guy degraded the girl. I think the girl chose something morally wrong herself and degraded herself. Modern feminism is distracting and troubling our traditional women in a dangerous way. But for those who understand a hint is enough. By watching such debates, they can get a good idea that these people don't have any answers other than agreeing with you. What do you think about this video? Do share in the comments. If you learned something from the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for listening and supporting me. Take care.